It's rare to say a movie had such a huge impact on society. However, the movie Jaws created a public fascination with sharks, which later led to a golden age of shark science that completely changed our view on the ocean and how it works. Careers were made, fortunes created, and the ways of directing, scoring movies, and shooting special effects were all changed forever when Jaws was released in 1976. Created something absolutely horrible. Shark attack on Sydney's so Bondi Beach. Four metre man eater grabbed Shannon's hand, trying Patty to. Patty Trumbull says she kicked and punched the two metre shark. And it got me under the water. The scourge of the ocean, and everyone should go and catch one. From birth, we're taught to fear sharks. Movies like Jaws and the media's reporting have given people the belief that all sharks are man eating monsters. Before the movie was released, people still feared the large animal, but didn't grow paranoia towards the idea of being attacked by one. This caused people to begin to slaughter opening an industry for shark-contained products. Every night I try to dream of what you wanted me to be You're alive Jaws terrified people to the point where we were running out at to sea, killing these gorgeous animals even at the expense of the ocean's health. Sharks play a vital role in the marine ecosystem, maintaining the balance in our oceans. Scientists warn that removing sharks will cause irreversible damage to our oceans and the species that inhabit them. Three sharks every second killed. 200,000 sharks every day gone. Up to 73 million sharks every year dead. Sharks that uh, were in their untold millions 50 to 60 years ago are now declining to 10% of their original values. When top predators disappear from the ecosystem, it's not an immediate change. Everything in the marine ecosystem is completely interconnected, so if you take the, the top predator or the apex predator out of that equation, it will have a trickle-down effect that affects every little niche of the marine ecosystem. Every hour, every day. They're on the top of the food chain. They regulate the abundance and diversity of species below them. For me, what if I die tomorrow? Will we really let one of the most awesome predators of the ocean go extinct? Populations of several shark species found in U.S. waters have declined by more than 97% in recent decades. Where sharks are caught, they can very easily be fins, the animal could still be alive, and that's a very brutal process to remove part of the animal's body and then throw it back in very often when, when it's still alive. Time, the last time.
together, we can make this change. The Conservation Act of 2009, sponsored by Senator John Kerry, is critical legislation that will help strengthen the U.S. ban on shark finning, improve shark fisheries data, and encourage international shark conservation. The U.S. House of Representatives passed its version of this bill last year by voice vote. the power to make a difference. The future shouldn't look like this. The future should allow these magnificent, misunderstood creatures roam free. Please, 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 please protect our shark.